Yes, first to breaking developments in that cross-country kidnapping, the Bethel Park woman left for dead in the Nevada desert. And new at five, we're hearing from investigators from Nevada about just how unusual this case is and the impact that it's having on them as they try to fill in the gaps from when Jamie Fedden disappeared to the discovery of her body and the arrest of John Chapman. Channel 11's Aaron Martin just talked to those investigators and he joins us now live. Aaron? And Lisa, I can tell you right now, those investigators along with Bethel Park detectives are continuing to meet behind me here at the Bethel Park Police Department as they try to piece together the timeline in this case. But I can tell you from our conversation just about an hour ago that there's a lot of emotion involved here, particularly for those investigators who are trying to get justice for a woman who can no longer speak for herself. I've been a uh, law enforcement officer for 15 years. I've never seen anything like this. Lincoln County Sheriff's Deputy Mike Ray has never been to Pittsburgh, but the death of Jamie Fedden brought him to the Steel City to meet with Bethel Park detectives as they worked to put together a timeline for Fedden and suspect John Chapman's trip to Nevada, where her body was ultimately found. Even though I thought I knew exactly what had happened, my eyes have been open to a lot more of what actually did Take place. Ray says seeing the evidence and reports in person is helping him sort through the convoluted oh, story. Investigators say Chapman confessed to the murder, but while walking into his preliminary hearing yesterday, I don't remember making that statement. Chapman claimed he was on medication when he confessed and he didn't kill her. Ray says investigators are working to bring justice for Fedden, doing so before her body was even identified. I know officers that would check every morning when they came to work to see if there was any new missing persons reports of someone that would match that description. And it was just something that was on our minds constantly until we got the call from Bethel Park. Now detectives are putting the finishing touches on an investigation with the decision to charge Chapman with homicide in the hands of the Lincoln County, Nevada District Attorney. We hope to have our reports together for him within a week of our return. And keep in mind, at this point, John, suspect, uh, John Chapman is only charged with kidnapping in this case. Whether that will be upgraded to homicide will ultimately be in the hands of Lincoln County, Nevada District Attorney, and it's unclear when that decision will be made. We're live tonight in Bethel Park. Aaron Martin, Channel 11 News.